6 o'clock. Good evening. I'd like to call to order the April 28, 2020 closed session meeting. I'd like to point out that this meeting is being hosted through live stream on the city's website and by teleconference for public comment. To accommodate public comment during this meeting, we have made temporary changes to the agenda that were necessitated to comply with the COVID-19 directives. Deputy City Clerk, may I have a roll call, please? Councilmember Meyer? Here. Councilmember Percival? Here. Councilmember Wright? Here. Mayor Fontaine Krupa? Here. Mayor Brown? Here. Thank you. We will now move to public comment period. Deputy City Clerk, were there any e-comments submitted to be read aloud for closed session items? No, Mayor, there are no e-comments submitted. Okay. Are there any members of the public participating through teleconference that would like to comment on any closed session items? I'll take that as a no. Before we get, begin, as a reminder, there is a temporary two-minute per person time limit for all general public comments on non-public hearing items. Comments should be directed to council as a whole. Let me turn that volume down. A little background music is bad. A little too loud. Okay, there is a temporary two minute per person time limit for all general public comments on non public hearing items. Comments should be directed to the council as a whole and not directed to individual council members. When providing public comment, please state your name for the record. So, with that, we will move into closed session. We have item 3A. 